Hello, very warm welcome. Manchester United secure top four with a 1-0 victory over West Ham at Old Trafford. Wasn't the most entertaining game, but United have done it. That secures top four for me. We got a nine points gap to West Ham. So surely that succeeds top four. Difficult game against West Ham as they're in top form. But, I mean, it wasn't pretty, but, wow. An own goal by Dawson on the 53rd minute gives Manchester United the win. And, yeah, we, we've cemented the Champions League, which is great. But the biggest game comes on Thursday when we play Milan. The lighting's really bad in the room, so I've had to try... Like change it round, so yeah. Chelsea drop points, a huge chance for us to get the gap out. Hopefully Rashford Rashford started, hopefully he's fully fit. He managed to get through the ninety, so that's good news. Uh, our bench was very weak. We had four defenders, two goalkeepers, couple of youngsters, Matic. Fred lucky not to get a yellow, cynical challenge. Boring first 20 minutes, no chances. Greenwood cross, Rashford's sitter of a header has got to do better. Then Greenwood had a finesse shot. It was a great save by Fabianski. Half-time, 0-0. Can't break down a defensive block. Greenwood, great. And great cross into the box. No one gambles at the back post. 1-0. Luke Shaw, player of the season, crosses it in. McTominay headed it. On to Dawson, own goal. And 1-0 up. David Moore has got his tactics completely wrong. West Ham have been a good team this season. He basically came, he parked the bus, tried to play for a draw. As soon as we went 1-0 up, he brings on his attacking players and plays expansive. Why didn't he do that from the get-go? Because I don't understand Moore's tactics. Like, criminal. And they actually looked decent when they started to play. Rash, uh, no, Greenwood hit the post. No subs made by Ole. Very interesting. Not amazing, but a win is a win. And that will secure the top four. I hate these kickoffs times with the passion. I mean, who wants to watch football on a Sunday night at quarter past seven? It's such a shit kickoff time. You've got to wait all day for your team to play. Huge chance to create a gap, and we did it. And a huge game against AC Milan on Thursday. That is absolutely massive. Biggest game of the season for me. We've got top four secured. Now we need to win a trophy. Manchester United won, West Ham nil. Match reaction, top four secured. Moyes' tactics, very questionable. Man United go back to second on 57. West Ham, 48, fifth. Bookings, Wampasaka, James, McTominay, Rashford. Substitutions, Johnson, Lanzini, Noble, Ben Rama. Referee, Atkinson. Uh, I believe it should have been... What's his face? One of them's got... Um, came into contact, COVID, so he's got to self-isolate. I forget his name now. Who was it? Was it Kavanagh, by any chance? Anyway... That's irrelevant. Atkinson was the referee. Man of the match, I would have to give it uh, the West Ham goalkeeper, Fabianski. Made critical saves, could have been a lot more. But David Moyes just didn't want to play. He came, he parked the bus, he played for the draw. It bit him on the arse. Then he started to play expansive, bringing the big guns on. And, yeah, I don't understand it by Moisey. Should have gone, gone for it from the get-go. But Manchester United secure top four. Bit of a weird match reaction. I didn't really enjoy the game. It's been a long day. Watch testing all day. Now I've got to wait till quarter past seven to watch the football. I despise these kickoff times. Comment down below. Would love to know your thoughts. United secure top four. Get in there. Huge. Absolutely huge. United top four. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. David Moyes, what were them tactics? Why didn't he go for it? Look out for a Milan preview. That is the biggest game of the season coming.
United win 1-0 and secure top four.